Um, the playground is designated as a national demonstration site for the seven principles of inclusive playground design. This program defines the seven principles of inclusive design that strive to create a truly inclusive and embracing play experience to meet the development needs of the whole child by intentionally providing opportunities for physical, cognitive, communicative, social, emotional, and sensory development. So with that, I want to invite uh, Council Member Chris Nunn to come up and say a few words. Right around the time of the first election, I uh, was out here and I was playing around. Kids are here. And I, I met this wonderful young lady, Skylin, and uh, her caretaker, Lee, and, and met their grandfather, uh, Wayne, after that by, by phone. And one of the things we talked about while they were here was, you know, there was nothing for her to do. You know, in order to get out of, of her chair into one of these... The handicap swings even was was a major undertaking and so with that i took that and i went to brian and i said you know what can we do to make our playgrounds more inclusive what can we do to actually get rid of the word ada accessible and make it ada inclusive brian is amazing he took that he made this happen he worked with our uh, our parks and rec committee they found the right playground to do what we wanted to do recognize we have our representative robbie brackett is here today uh, City of Sebastian Mayor Ed Dodd, Vice Mayor Kelly Dixon, Council Member Chris Nunn, Council Member Fred Jones, and I also want to thank Council Member Bob McPartland. We have uh, County Commission Chair Susan Adams is here today, and County Commissioner uh, Vice Chair Mr. Joe Flesher is here as well. And we have uh, Vero Beach Council Member Tracy Zudans is here as well. Thank you all for coming. I want to recognize um, the Learning Nest Preschool. They were invited and invited to come and join us here today uh, for the ribbon cutting, and we're glad to have them here a part of this. And I uh, hope the kids enjoy the new playground. So thank you all for participating. And last but certainly not least, I want to thank all of our city staff that played a very integral role in, in seeing this project through. I know they were out here every single day for the past two months. Um, our staff handled the demolition of the old playground, and they also kind of saw it all the way through the process. Um, many departments were involved in this, Public Works Department, Stormwater Department, Public Facilities, and our Parks Department, and uh, thanks to all the other departments that had involvement in this as well. And I do want to recognize our Park Superintendent, Antoine Van Meer. He thank you for, for your daily involvement in the installation, uh, being out here every single day and, and checking on this playground. So thank you for that, and thank you for your oversight in the Parks Department as well.